Hi, I'm Ron Walborn. The Spiritual Formation series that you're about to participate in is designed to help you fight the right battles. You see, I believe many times when it comes to our spiritual growth, spiritual formation, we are focused on fighting all the wrong battles. We get focused on behaviors, sins, the externals, when the reality is God has to do a heart work. Now, the bounded set also includes not just external behaviors, but internal attitudes. You begin to hear things like, a real Christian, a good Christian, is never angry, is never depressed, is always happy, and always at peace. And so, in its demand for performance, the bounded set does not allow us to be real and does not allow us to be honest with the way things really are in our heart. We need to ask ourselves these questions. What are the habits, who are the people, and where are the places that nourish the seed of God in my life? What are the habits in my life? What are the, what are the things that I do that when I do them, I feel the life of God, the seed of God that's nourished and fed? I know we don't enjoy the pain, but the enemy wants to keep you locked up. He wants you to look back at the past and say, I don't want to go there. In fact, if you do go there, you'll never get out. The tears will be too much. But folks, that's a lie. And as you begin to take the wall down and say, Lord, I'll go there with you. I'll feel that pain of that past grief, that past memory. Then he begins to tear the wall down and allow you to experience new joy, even in the midst of the morning as well. The truth is, joy really does come in the morning. M-O-U-R-N-I-N-G. And when he says he made garments of skin for Adam and his wife and clothed them, he uses a word in the Hebrew that is the word labesh. It means to cover. It means to make sure that you're not being exposed, that you're safe, that you're cared for. For our group time today, we're going to do some declarations from Neil Anderson's Victory Over Darkness. These are declarations about who you are in Christ. They're declarations of truth about your acceptance, about your significance, about your security. And they come directly from God's Word. And so I want you now to stand wherever you are, if you're in a group, if you're alone, and I want you to begin to make these declarations with me. Here we go. I am accepted. I am God's child. As a disciple, I am a friend of Jesus Christ. I have been justified. I am united with the Lord and I am one with Him in spirit. I have been bought with a price and I belong to God. I am a member of Christ's body. I have been chosen by God and adopted as His child. I have been redeemed and forgiven of all my sins. I am complete in Christ. I have direct access to the throne of grace through Jesus Christ. I want to take some time at the very beginning of this series to talk to you about learning to fight the battle for your heart and not just the battle for your behavior or the battle for the externals.